Jen, how do I make those little highlight circles on my Instagram feed look so cute? Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you just that. I'm gonna turn around, show you my screen. We're gonna be using Canva to create some simple images to give your Instagram highlights a little pizzazz. All right, so here we are over on canva.com. This is a free website that you can use to create amazing graphics for so many different things. But today I'm gonna show you how to simply create highlight images that you can add to your Instagram stories. So the first thing you wanna do is make sure you have a Canva account and you can set that up just using your email. From there, you're going to actually click on the template that says social media and it's just the standard square and it's 800 by 800 in pixel size in case you needed to know the actual dimensions, but there is a template that you can click on. It's the very first template option. And what you're gonna see is, you're gonna see all these different uh, layouts over here that you can use, but what we're gonna do is actually create our own image from scratch. The first thing you wanna do is click on elements and you want to go to shapes. When you go to shapes, we are going to grab a circle. It could be any circle you desire to use. So for now, I'm gonna use this standard circle and just drag it over. Now, if you have branded colors or a specific color scheme you wanna use, you can definitely include that. So just pick whatever color uh, that your heart desires. And I'm gonna go ahead and start with black. And I'm actually going to be updating my highlights on Instagram as well. FYI, if we're not friends over there, you can definitely come connect with me at my handle. It's at meet Jen Johnson. And so you'll see my stories changing a little bit and I'll be adding more to them uh, as the time goes on here. And so one that I wanted to add was resources. And so what I'm gonna do is probably grab a, an image of a book. So what's cool is that the search section, you can come up here and type in any keyword and it will bring up different types of images for you. And so I can include, you know, any, you know, I just find an image that I think pops or one that I would want to use. And so I think I'm just gonna start with trying this one here. So this says, this is like a little book image and I'm going to add that to my image here and you can always see if it's lined up because the little lines will start to pop up there and I think I want to make this I can make it pink I can make it gold maybe I'll make it gold and we'll see what this looks like I can kind of blow it up a little bit more hopefully it'll be people will be able to tell what that is and so say I have my image all done here. Now you can get fancy and you can go back to elements and um, you know find a different, like a circle frame kind of thing if you wanted to add something around it like that you could. And, or if you wanted to just, you know, you know, play with this and have fun, you can totally do that. So I'm gonna go ahead and just say that this is my image for now and download, but before I download it, I need to make sure I click this little box that says transparent background because I don't want any of the white showing, which it technically shouldn't anyways, if you you know line it up properly. Uh, but just to be safe, I turn it into a transparent background so you don't see any of the white that's going on in the background. So I'm gonna hit download, and then what I'm gonna do is head over to my phone so you can see what's going on and how I upload it from there. All right, so what I've done is I've airdropped the image to my phone. You can email the image to your phone. Just get it onto your phone and then we can head over to Instagram and what we're going to do is create a new highlight reel. So what, I, what you're gonna do is be on the home page, and you're gonna swipe right and, hi there, you're going to click on the images and grab the image that you just created and you're basically going to add that to your story. So I've added it to my story. Once it's in your story, you can click on the story to see it. And then you're gonna click on the heart that says highlight, and then you're gonna either add it to a highlight you already have that you want to make a cover for, or create a new highlight. So in my case, I'm creating a new highlight, and I'm going to highlight it resources. And I'm going to hit add. And there you have it. So when you go back to look at your highlights, it's going to be right there. Ta-da! And you can capitalize it. You can however you want to 
make it look, you can make it have fun with it. So that is the easy peasy way to go about making a cute little highlight for your Instagram stories. And there you have it, easy peasy lemon squeezy. I would love to hear what kind of highlights you're actually creating because I know there's so many people who struggle with this and what to talk about and how to keep their highlights and their stories interesting. So be sure to drop some of your ideas below. And if you want more tutorial videos like this, just be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe and comment below with maybe something that you're getting stumped on technically or you want to learn a little simple tutorial on and I would love to create more videos just like this to help you out. Other than that, later Gator.